Venice, a city full of life with studying art and architecture. If you're flying into nearby Marco Polo Airport, how does one get to the city where time has been suspended? Before we explain it all, please take time to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And remember to ring the notification bell to always be in the know. There is no city quite like Venice. Floating on the water, its existence dictated by the tides. The city is a living time capsule. The main international airport servicing Venice is Marco Polo Airport, located 13 kilometers from Venice on the mainland. To get to Venice from the airport, there are numerous options available, either by land, crossing the viaduct that connects the city to the modern world, or by boat, the way countless generations first reached the city. The cost can vary greatly depending on which method you select. Depending on the number of people in your party, the amount of luggage you are taking, cost, time, and how fit you are will determine which option you will take. There are two bus options, ATVO and ACTV. By boat, there are two options, private water taxi and the water bus. Bus options. ATVO Express Bus departs Marco Polo Airport every 30 minutes and provides non-stop service to Piazzale Rome, the very western edge of the city. The trip costs is 8 euro and takes approximately 20 minutes. The bus is comfortable, roomy, and has storage for luggage under the coach. To purchase tickets, you can use the numerous kiosks throughout the airport, the ticket office, or buy tickets from the driver. The public bus number 5, run by ACTV, also runs from Marco Polo Airport and Piazzale Roma and costs 8 euro. The buses run every 15 minutes and takes between 25 and 30 minutes, but stops along the way between the airport and Piazzale Roma. You need to carry your luggage onto the bus with you, there is no storage under the coach. Because number 5 is a public bus, you can buy an Aerobus Plus Nave ticket that combines the bus ride and the Vaporetta water bus to or from Piazzale Roma in Venice. Boat Options The water bus operated by Alaguna run three lines between Marco Polo Airport and Venice. The trips average about an hour and 15 minutes, depending on where you get off, much slower than the bus. If you have time before checking in at your hotel, this can be a very relaxing, and if you don't nod off, a very memorable journey. There are three lines that go into Venice from the airport, the blue, orange, and red lines. If your accommodation happen to be close to one of the stops, then this might be a great option. A one-way ticket will cost you 15 euro, 27 euro for a return ticket. Children pay full price. Tickets can be purchased in the arrivals hall of the airport or down at the docks, about a 10 minute walk once outside of the airport. Just follow the signs. Once on board, please validate your ticket. If you have a lot of luggage, allow extra time to get to the dock. The water buses leave every hour, so they are a little bit more infrequent than the land bus, but still a viable option for a reasonable price. Water taxi. A typical water taxi can run anywhere from 100 to 150 euro, depending on exactly where you are going in Venice and the amount of luggage you have. If you have a large group, this might be worth considering, as you can split the fare. As with any taxi, negotiate the price before getting into the boat to avoid any surprises. Get to know the landmarks of Venice, so you can make a more informed decision about getting into Venice and where you want to go. Piazzale Roma is in the westernmost section of the city and is where all the bus drop-offs occur. Other areas to know are the Rialto Bridge, San Marco, and the Academia. Once in the city, the best way to get around is by foot or by Vaporetta service provided by ACTV. Think bus, but it is a boat. There are many routes to explore. Well, thank you for watching, and if you've enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Till next time, happy and safe travels.